What to do, players and trainers? Actually, I probably started the music. I want to get all my music in. What to do, players and trainers? It's your boy, the Blazing Squid. Up this week, we're up against the Goodyear Gujos and their coach, Shane. Shane is also 5-2, and two, guys. This is going to be a, a match of the top four teams. There's top four teams, including Antony. I think, no. Yeah, in my division, it's Isaac, me, and Shane at 5-2. And then I think Arthur is also at 5-2, and Antonio's 5-2, and even little Jack is up there with the 5-2. It's pretty, it got some high-tier stuff, so Shane is going to be probably with some powerful stuff. I didn't really prep for the Dragology. It could come. It's a possibility, but I think I have a few checks for it. What is my team? My team is a potential leading Zero Aura here. We got Protect to Scout, plus the recoil damage will be super, super nice on the Mega Low Bunny. We have, Inca and we can scout Scarf, Mammal Swine. We also have a Zydog here, Choice Bandit. As soon as I can wear down his whole team, we are good to go. We are good to start getting a lot of damage. Volcarona is not going to want to take a thousand arrows. Chica, like a lot of his team is not going to appreciate it. The only thing I could take it is his Grass type. I'm not sure who's his Grass type, but I don't see his Grass type coming. We have Scrafty, Scrafty. If I can get a Dragon Dance up, we're looking really good because a Dragon Dance plus the Slurp Puffs Sticky Webs will be awesome, especially defensive to take on the Hydreigon. I know I'll take a few hits. Hydreigon usually likes to come. Hydreigon could be Scarf. Scarf, Hydreigon is never a bad ring. And then we have Victini. Victini is going to be super fast to outspeed in case his Hydreigon isn't Scarf enough. And then as long as we have those Sticky Webs, as long as Claydol doesn't come, Victini does work. Uh, that expert belt is like super super nice for the Volcarona, and then we have a very it's a more bulky um, Mega Pidgeot this week. We got substitute, we got protect, and we have roost. So like that's like we're gonna anticipate a Draco. Just go for that substitute, let him drop to neck two, get off a of roost, maybe even substitute again. You know, just a little bit of mind games here and there. But with that said, Shane has been waiting. Let's play some Pokemon, guys. Let's play the game. All right, so what is he bringing though? That's my question. Oh, he brought oh he brought bronze on. I didn't expect bronze on. I really didn't. Okay. But no Volcarona, so that means I can get up webs for free. Slows down everything, but oof, this is an interesting matchup. No Dragology. I only guess half his team right. My question is, what if I, I didn't? So I can't, I can't go for my my hurricanes yet, just yet. That's gonna be super unfortunate. A thousand arrows is super nice. It is super nice though. Um, I might lead my sash user. Right? We got Vicavolt here. Ooh, Shane is gonna be a nice opponent here. Shane is going to be an amazing opponent. Who am I missing? Elamomola. Why would he bring that? I, I don't get that part. That part I don't get. Yeah, he probably has a reason why. I don't have my lead selected yet. Um, I knew I needed Heat Wave. Maybe I didn't need Heat Wave. Uh, there's a good chance... He might lead off Mega Low Punny to get off a fake out, and I'm just gonna protect there, and then we will close combat to get rid of it. And if she switches out, she, I mean he. Well, Mega Low Punny should be a female. Well, I can't say she should be. It might be. Who knows? But let's find out. Let's get this match started. All right, Shane. Good luck. No, not good luck. Have fun. Have fun. I only say have fun because I don't want any hacks or anything like that but here comes lightning the zero aura as mammal swine does lead off okay okay do i scout or close combat right away if he's scar do i kill right away oh wait let me open up a google doc in case i want to take notes of who kills who I don't have my sets imported, so that's gonna be a little bit annoying because I gotta put everything manually. Uh, but let's see, calculator, zero aura. It's not life orb, it's just adamant. Hey, mammal swine, life orb. 50-50, uh, close combat. If I was adamant, no life orb, do I kill? 
It's a roll to kill. Oof. I can't let him get rocks up for free, though. Just like that, I can't let him get rocks up. I'm going for it. Close combat. Let's go for it. Are you Sash? Do we get the high roll? Oof, just barely missing the roll. Just barely missing the roll. Does go for the earthquake, though. Does go for the earthquake. He was probably Sash. If you ask me. If you ask me, he had to be Sash. Alright, so we're going to exchange Mons there. He is going to go for the Ice Shard, most likely. I wish I had Fake Out. Fake Out plus Close Combat would have been it. But getting rid of Mammoth Swine leaves... Um, it leaves 1,000 arrows. Super nice. Because I don't have to worry about an Ice Shard. Alright, so we don't get any info. It's not Life Orb. It could potentially be Focus Ash by the way he led with it. Um, if he's banded, he stays in for sure and just clicks Earthquake again. If he makes the re, <laughs> he's, he just clicks Earthquake. He swaps out then. Oof, if he swaps out, I just waste an Intimidate. Yikes, that's no bueno. That is not good whatsoever. I think Scrafty's an obvious switch in here though. No, 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 not necessarily, because Mega Pidgeot can also come in. Mega Pidgeot could come in as well. Um, Super, what would stink a lot was, he can actually have the better matchup here. Let's see, let's see. Let's see what he does here. I'm actually, he's taking his time. I'm going to swap out. If he goes for rocks, then I am looking not so pretty. But if I can get two Dragon Dances off, we are looking very pretty. Endeavor. Um, so I guess he doesn't have the Ice Shard. Meaning... He tries to kill me here and I go into Pidgeot? He doesn't have the ice shard. There's no way you kick you click it twice. I'm gonna swap out again. I'm gonna swap out. The music's over because that is a crazy tech. I'm actually in shock right now because Um I had just I killed. He stayed in though. So show me the ice shard. I'm bulky. Don't go icicle crash. Ice shard. What does that do? I'm a little bit bulky, 181. I can still roost up. I can still roost up. But that's just annoying. What was I doing to Pidgeot? If it wasn't for the bulk, I would have not lived. There's another Ice Shard. 19 down to kill. Perfect. Okay. And that's just like awesome. <sighs> Alright, he's at neg 2. Ice Shard is doing nothing. I got a free U turn off. That's just straight up annoying. But that's fine. That's fine. I can still I can still work with it. He doesn't know if I'm scarfed or anything like that. He just has to go for straight U turn. Uh, Endeavor was an amazing play. I should have just sacked Zero Aura. I don't know what else do I need it for. Besides potentially clicking Plasma Fist. It is Death Fodder. Man, I really need a Scrafty though. Mammal Swine kills. Okay, you don't want to type. Mammal Swine. Kills. Scrafty. 
Ooh, I can go for um, webs here. Is it worth it? Or do I just plasma fist? Let me see if I can get Pidgeot healthy. If I can get Pidgeot healthy, I'll feel so much better about this match. There's the lefties. If you burn me, so be it. But I'm just gonna boost up. I need some type of some type of leverage here, which is no leverage whatsoever. <laughs> so my client skills crafty with I4. I don't even know how much I was doing. I don't know. Ice Shard was 60 to 72 if he was adamant. He's at neg one. It was doing like 50%, so obviously I would have been taking those up for days. I have like about 180 invested in defense. I was supposed to be doing 36 to 43%. If he crit like he did, it's pretty 79 to 30, 93. So yeah, as expected. Goes for Toxic. I do have Aromatherapy, so I'm not like super, super mad about that. I have a much healthier Ingram now though, so I could switch out, get up webs, and potentially Aromatherapy. Yeah, I, I like that, I like that. So we can go into Cotton Guard here. Cotton Candy, I, I'm much healthier now. So I'm just happy I'm much healthier. That's, that's, I could have gone for another one, but it's fine. There's the wish. Um, seeing that you have wish, um, I might just flamethrower, or do I sticky webs? I can't really knock you out, and you can't let me set up. So I'll stick webs. Let's neutralize the Mega Lope, honey. That's about it. That's all I stopped, Mega Lope, honey. You probably go into Bronze on, though. Yeah, Bronze on. All right, so webs are good now because that really cripples the... You're probably gonna get rocks up. If I was you, do you get rocks up? Yeah, because rocks are awesome. Rocks is awesome. I need a scrap to win, especially against this team. I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna go into Victini. I'm. I'm gonna try to recreate. I'm gonna try to recreate. If you're Aka Berry, awesome on you. I should have burned it when I had the chance. And if you're, there's a self rocks. That's just a good play. That's just a good play overall. Um. So I have a death fodder now. Super nice. I want to see how much I do to Alva Mamola though. If it's defensive, do I still kill with Vitini here? You don't know my set. Uh, choice. Bandage is almost it. I don't kill. It's a two shot, guys. I have to double bolt strike, to tell you the truth, in order to have any chance whatsoever. I have to make a read into Alan Mola. If you're heat proof, you stay in. If you're. I, it's that V create does 22. He does switch out. Mammal? Alan Mola. Perfect. Okay. Caught in the sticky webs. I'm able to go for ball strike. Do about 50%.
as I was mentioning, I'm able to go for ball strike, do 50%. <laughs> oh my god, that's just that's just great. That's phenomenal. That's just perfect. <sighs> wow, I should just click the create because. Big Create doesn't have a chance to miss. I'm just gonna click in Bulk Strike. I'm gonna keep clicking it till. It, this, oh my god, I'm just so annoyed right now. This would have been a two shot. Nope, it's not a two shot unless I just got low rolled. There's a knockoff. It's gonna do a lot. It's a. <laughs> oh my god. I'm trying to find a way to f keep my cool without losing my cool, but it's so hard to keep it. I don't know why. I don't know why. Thank you for everything you've done. There's the wish. <sighs> Without the expert bill, I do not kill whatsoever now. Unless I'm not even gonna mention anything. Um. Crypto could come in, I'm supposed to be adamant and I'm jolly. <sighs> okay, that's fine. I just remembered right now, I'm supposed to be jolly. I'm not. 44 to 51, that's without rage banded. Uh, a thousand arrows is a two shot, but anything in his team is getting life back. Uh, he has to go for liquidation. He's gonna heal up all that HP though. So am I forced to go into Ingram and click Hurricane? I can't let him like heal up anything relatively healthy, so I'm just gonna click his in head fight here. I I know I actually I actually need Victoria to win this, but I, I'm at this point it's just that ball strike miss hurts so much. And the, the crits just really, 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 really are just atrocious to go through. Yeah, there you go. Oh man, that's fine. That's fine. What am I supposed to do? It's a 93% accurate move. With the, you know, including the victory, uh, its ability. Yeah, Victini's viability is so low now that it's ridiculous. Okay, um, this is why I want to hit on a special side with Thunderbolt too. I tried should have gone with a gut instrument and just clicked Thunderbolt. I should have brought a special set like I wanted to. Just I just keep clicking Thunderbolt, so I don't know. Is that the calc set? Oh, I no. Well, it's a Volcarona does more. This. Oh, I just clicked clicking A and I forgot that you could potentially switch out like you just did. I'm at 41 HP with Vitini. Do I live another entry to rocks? I don't. So I'm just gonna be create as he U turns out or dog follows or whatever he does. Cause it's obviously scarfed and uh, I'm just annoyed. I'm just annoyed. I'm just annoyed. Uh, I'm just annoyed so much. That's fine though. It's fine. 
It's fine. It's just fine. I don't. I just. Oh, he's not scarred. That's fine though. I'm just gonna get hopefully good damage off. That's not even good damage. I don't consider that good damage. Now the fact that he's not scarred is like it stinks because how do you live on one? How? Just how? Well, Mammoth Swine comes in. Right? Is the mouse one? Be created away. I know this is not probably gonna be my best commentary. So, uh, with that said, guys, how's your day going? How's your LDL battle going? If you're watching from LDL. And, dude, I knew the curse was coming, man. Isaac supposedly had very bad luck last night, and I was like, if Isaac had bad luck, there's a 99% chance I'm probably going to have bad luck. And here we are. Um, he doesn't ever switch. Doesn't gleam just for stab. Just stab, doesn't gleam. Like, I, he switches in out of Mola. I wish I had Toxic. I do wish I had Toxic. I wish I had defog. I wish I had a lot of things. I wish I had rocks. Actually has bronze. He switches in bronze on. Okay, that's not the worst case scenario. And that does nothing. Leftovers, show me the lefties. Show me the lefties. No lefties. So I'm a flamethrower. And then I'll dazzling gleam. But I can only do so much. I miss Mega Hundu. I miss Mega, Mega Hundu was able to like take on Alamomola with no problem. And now that he's not here, it's like sad days, you know? Yep, that's heat proof. Has to be. There's no way it's not. Can I at least get one kill this match? I'm not sure. Doesn't hurt to try. I was supposed to click Dazzling Gleam as he switched in Alamomola. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, it's a 6 0. That's just great. Oh, that's just great. It is a 6 0. It's a 6 0. Oh, man. It's a 6 0. Oh, shit. Alright. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, who dies second? Zero Aura? Yeah. Dies to Stealth Rocks. Uh, oh, let's just click Thousand Arrows. Like, I have nothing else to click. Um, it's at full HP, too. It's just. We're not gonna make it far. It's not okay. So yeah, continue on with our little graph here. Mammoth Swine kills uh, Scrafty with ice shards. Um, who else died? Who died next after that? Slurpuff? No. Mammoth Swine kills. Bitini ice shard. 
you know, I've never lost a game with Zygarde on my team. And that has officially been broken. It's officially been broken. Um, so, Mamoswine kills Scrap with Dice Shards, or Orta dies to Stealth Rocks. Mamoswine kills Victini with Stealth Rocks. I mean, uh, Bronzon kills Slurpuff with Gyro Ball. Uh, who do I have left? I could switch out, but I don't see the point in that. So, Alamomola. Something's gonna kill Zygarde here. Something has to kill it, unless you wish. You know, I probably should have rolled with therapy just to keep Pidgeot healthy and like substitute. Like I wouldn't be mad if I had just substitute. Like, had I brought Heat Wave instead of Protect, would have been so much like probably late game, potentially chance to pull back. But we can only do so much now. She does protect though. I mean, he. Short, I don't know if Alamomola is a she. Is it a she or a he? It is a she, so she did protect. So we're just gonna keep clicking A here till. Zero. Till Zygarde goes down, man. Yes, yeah, so a crit! Wow, that's amazing. And there's the toxic. Yay, awesome, great. Okay. Maybe I can stall out Zaya. Nope, I can't stall out Bronzong. Mm. Like, bro, if you're not gonna kill me, I'm just gonna kill myself. To tell you the truth, Shane, if you're not gonna kill me, I'll just kill myself. Like, let me do the honors for you. I'll do it for you. If you click protect, protect obviously. I'm, I'm just I'm not gonna do this today, bro. Not today. Not with the game I just played through. I'm sorry. Hey, no disrespect to you whatsoever, but if you're just gonna sit there and toxic and and protect and wish and protect and toxic after you've already six old me, I'm um, I'm just gonna do you the favor and give you a six O. So Pidgeot dies to rocks. Self rocks and Zygarde ten percent dies. Somebody kills ten percent. I don't know who kills you. Uh, we'll give the last kill to like. Mammal swine, mammal swine. Kills. So we'll just switch back out into Ingram and the Pidgeot. So mammal swine kills. I, so I just gave Bronze on a nice three kills that I deserve this match. Congratulations, Bronze on. Uh, so mammal swine kills Zygarde 10%. Let's say that. Oh, there's the knockoff. That's the good old spear I'm looking for. Nope. Bronze on because I'm gonna click outrage to see if I can even make it somewhat through. Nope, you know what? Let's just give it to Alamomola. Alamomola kills because I'm not gonna spend another turn here. Players and trainers, you guys are amazing. Stay blazing. Congratulations, Shane, with the 6 0. Peace.